Some 62 residents of Anai Region 9 are now certified in the area of garment construction following the Community Service Officers CSO's graduation on Saturday. Amerindian Affairs Minister Pauline Sukai highlighted that the aim of the CSO program is to engage and extend opportunities to young people so that they are able to make meaningful contributions to their communities. There are many opportunities that abound in our country, both skill and academic. But there is still that section or portion of our population who needs support to really experience the kind of exposure but cannot afford it. And so under the CSO program, which falls under the Youth Entrepreneurial Apprenticeship Program, we are making it possible. The CSO program is a representation of the government's commitment to creating employment opportunities in hinterland communities. We represent the PPP civic government who now holds the reins of power and has the responsibility for ensuring that opportunities are made accessible for those who cannot pay for it, neither can it afford it. It is an experience we want to provide to the young people who are vulnerable in various villages in the hinterland regions. Minister Sukai added that the program serves as the gateway to entrepreneurship and urged the graduates to take advantage of the opportunity to venture into that field. You're young, you need the support, you need access to making life better for yourselves, and you have to start somewhere. So the CSO program, or DEEP as we refer to it in the formal title of the program, this is a stepping stone. The YEEP program, which was reinstated in 2020, is indicative of the government's unwavering support for youths of Indigenous communities.